everybody. It's August 14, 2011. It's a Sunday, a rainy Sunday. My kids are both home from camp safe and sound and happy. They had a great summer, both of them. And yesterday when I picked them up at the bus, I was walking from the bus to the car and some woman almost hit me pulling out of a spot and somebody said, watch out. And so I did. And then the lady gave me the finger, which was weird because it wasn't even texting or anything. But my kid said it was totally her fault and she was mean. So there you go. And uh, I have to try not to care about mean people because there are mean people everywhere. Like on Twitter. Blech. Okay, so where do I shop online? I like Revolve Clothing. I like a store called BlueHeavenBoutique.com. They sell dresses by this company, Daughters of the Revolution, and they're so cute. I like Shop Bop. I like Soulstruck for shoes. I go to Mac for some makeup. I use Amazon for everything I could possibly buy, including, the person who wants to know my fanny pack. This is the fanny pack I use when I go outside. The brand is Nathan. And it's good because it's lightweight. It was not expensive. Totally worth your while. Holds a lot of stuff. Uh, when, during my weight loss journey, did I feel like I was, I was going to get there? And this is from someone who wants to lose a lot of weight. And did I feel invigorated? Yeesh. Uh, um, I don't ever feel like I'm really going to get anywhere, frankly. Whether it's with my weight or my work or my life. Everything is a struggle. It's like just one thing after the other. And I try to just focus on the good and let the rest sort of go. And it's moments and moments of feeling invigorated and happy and excited and then moments of just unbelievable terror and feeling like crap. But I just try to focus on the better moments and, and uh, plow through the rest. Just It's like always just moving one step in front of the other. I don't ever give up on anything. That's like kind of my motto. I try to never give up on anything to the best of my ability. And I have setbacks and like I said earlier, people hurt my feelings. Like the whole Twitter thing. There are some really mean people. I don't understand it. I don't have to. I just have to read it because it comes my way and let it go and wish them peace. Uh, how long do I do the treadmill for? And how long did I do it before I started running? I try to work out for an hour at least. And I run in spurts. I watch my heart rate. I wear a heart rate monitor. And I don't like to go above 160 in heart rate and running pushes it up, walking doesn't, talking, singing, walking does, so I watch how high it is, and uh, I'm a nervous Nelly, so that's why I had the heart rate monitor. Um, how did I learn to calorie count? Well, I've been calorie counting forever, so I've known the calorie counts of things for a long, long time. Once you know them, it's easy to count them. I'm really bad at math in any other capacity. I can only calorie count. I'm like really, really challenged slash touched when it comes to math and numbers, but calories now it's almost by rote because I've been doing it for so long. I used to go to Weight Watchers, but once I started really being able to weigh myself, I felt like I didn't have to. I could just weigh myself. Uh, my hair is gross today. Sorry. Um, Best music genre for me to sing? Hmm. Torch songs and show tunes and I'm not a pop music singer. I don't sing pop music well, except I like to because I hear it in the car and it's fun and makes me think I'm hip. Opera word is makes me think I'm hip. It doesn't mean that I am hip. And I think I'm going to sing a little Adele for you, which it's like, rule is rule of singing and stuff is never sing someone with a hit song. So it's a big mistake, but I'll do it because you asked. And I have no idea what makes a great radio or TV host. I just like some people on TV and on the radio, but I'm not sure exactly the reason. I think it's something probably I can't even put my finger on. Okay, this song. Here we go. Be kind. Okay. Never mind, I'll find someone like you. I wish nothing but the best for you, too. Don't forget me, I bet I'll remember you said. Sometimes it lasts in love, but sometimes.
sometimes it hurts instead. Never mind, I'll find someone like you. I wish nothing but the best for you, too. I think that's enough. So have a great Sunday. Please leave questions, comments, requests at justjenny.com. I love the new chat feature on my site. I chat there like every night. And I go in throughout the day. I'm kooky. We know this. I like to connect. All right. Have a good day, everybody. Bye-bye.